Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to BCW. I am your host, Jay, and I'm here with my psycho partner, Mick Foster. Hello, it's Mick Foster, all time legend, and I am here with Jay, and we're getting ready for the first match, which I believe is a tag team match set for one fall. Yeah, and if I'm in, if I'm not cor incorrect in saying this is a match between Money Inc. and the one and only Unforgotten unfor Error, uh, again that's, this name. That's... Yes. Yeah, we'll find out. <laughs> it most definitely, it most, it will be. Obviously, we've got the team of uh, Razor Ray and um, Tyler West. Tyler West being the one with the mohawk coming in ahead. Razor Ray, the man behind him with the longer hair. Now, personally, I don't know too much about either of these tag teams, aside from the fact that one of these tag teams is a two-time tag team champion over in GPW. And uh, the other team, I don't know too much. Oh, they are one half of the Revolution tag team partner. Oh, okay. Yes, I'm... Um, okay. Big. So, you know what? I have high hopes for this matchup. I'm, obviously, I'm hoping that this matchup doesn't, you know, it doesn't disappoint because as they're coming down to the ring, they have, so far I'm seeing like Money Inc have that swagger. You know, they have that, that style that it's just a little, it's like a little bit intoxicating, you know what I'm saying? They have like that um, millennial I, style. I personally don't like it. They're a bit too cocky for me. I, you know what? This is probably because you're old, but obviously you need to accept the fact that times are changing and that these guys seem like they're the type of guys that somewhat connect with the fans, you know? They've got a, Look at him! Look at him! Look at Razor Ray, man! When was the last time that you saw someone like that boogieing? It looks... It's, it's oh, just... God. look great! And now, their opponents for the evening making their way down to the ring. It is the team of Alex and Dustin Kane! See, look at them. They're more prepared. They're more ready to go. Nah, you just, you just like, bore, you just like when people are just too calm. I mean... I bet you they're going to win the match tonight. I, I, I can, mean, I really, realistically speaking, right, Alex remind now that I look at him, does he not remind you a bit of that guy from uh, that song? Uh, hang on. All-Star. Yeah, that one song, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Smash Mouth, yeah. <laughs> Smash Mouth, yeah, yeah. Does that remind you just a little bit? Well, you know what? Smash Mouth was in Shrek, and Shrek was a good movie. Oh, dude, don't. Just, no, shut up. No. <laughs> Have you not seen Shrek? No, Shrek is a good movie. That song is not. <laughs> so, um, while we're talking about Shrek, which one's your favourite movie? Uh, first one. Or... Oh, okay. Or the third, maybe. I was, I was a big fan of the second movie, honestly. Honestly, don't see how any of that has to do with wrestling. I mean, that, then me, again... the first movie, Shrek wrestles. That's, yeah, that's true. That is true. Yeah, you got a point. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, we, on to the match. Here we have it. The first man and in the, the ring. Rings. Tyler and Alex in the ring first. Now, oh. Tyler... Going straight in with the forearm, using that swagger to spin around and bring the arm down onto his knee, giving a little bit of a uh, pain to him. <laughs> See, to me, I personally don't like tag team matches. They're a bit too, um, I guess a singles matches are a bit more um, fair in my eyes. Like tag team matches, there's a bit more um, unfairness to it. And yeah. you can be a bit, um, it just seems a bit more like you're relying on your teammate more than anything. Yeah, I can understand that aspect of you you thinking that is a little bit more unfair. And yeah, it does usually come down to you relying on your teammate. But I think that there's a certain level of skill required when it comes to doing tag team matches that is just not, it's uncomparable. Like, when you think about it, when you're doing a tag team match, nine times out of 10, you're going to have to be on them point with your tag team partner for you guys to even be able to come out on top it requires not only for you to be in top top condition but for your partner to be in tip top condition and for your teamwork and chemistry to also be in tip top condition so when it comes down to it i feel like be a tag team uh, tag team matches they do tend to be just a little bit more 
Um, now what's the word I'm looking for? I don't want to see it's more skillful, but I just feel like there's a lot more that goes into it than in a singles match. You know, you only have to rely on whether you can beat the other guy. Well, I did used to be a tag team competitor myself um, back in the day. Um, we were, me and my partner were a bit of a um, good team. But, uh, you know, they normally stab you in the back, they do, as I've uh, seemed to learn. Ah, right. So you're just salty. All right, fair enough. <laughs> the tag's <Interesting>. been... <laughs> ruined my career. Ah, you're talking about uh, the Mr. Hunter House Helmsley, yes? Yes, Mr. Hunter House Helmsley. It was the uh, combination of uh, Triple H and Triple H. Um, great team. Obviously, I was a bit of a... Um, oh, that power bomb. But yeah, I was a bit disabled anyway. So, um, and it was a running joke. My um, son used to call me that, but I uh, took it to the ring. Me and Triple H uh, formed that group. That's actually how we got his name, actually, um, speaking of which. Oh, um, H, and he was, um... Okay, I lie, I lie, I lie. Okay, he had his first name. <laughs> right. <laughs> but, um, anyways, yeah, that happened, and um, he stabbed me in the back, hit me with um, his sledgehammer on my leg, and hasn't been the same since. Uh, that's a sad story, but you know what isn't sad at the moment, <laughs> Mick? How Dustin is doing in this matchup right now as he hits him with the discus forearm. And you see, just because sometimes tag teams fall apart does not mean anything as he goes to cover one, then a kick out. Obviously, so far, both teams are doing well, both Immortal and, pardon me, Money that Inc. are both doing fantastically. Do, um, some tag teams are really good together. I've met some tag teams that work wonderfully. Oh, that knee. All right, we're Jesus. going for the cover. Looks like we got a distraction. Oh, it looks like the distractions actually work because the referee, is, he's been down for a while too and a kick out. Now, you see, that, that could have been the been, match. Yeah. That could have been the match right there. But obviously, the distraction um, of Tyler West meant that the referee was away from the pin long enough to give um, Razor Ray a chance to actually recover. Now, Razor Ray, Ray turning him back into the corner and we'll see another tag. Nope, not this time. Looks like he's putting him in the position of the tree of woe. And now that I've seen some, I've seen some things. You know, getting need in the chest from that position is not comfortable at all. It's just, it's not, not nice. It makes you, it's, that position makes you feel like you're uh, very vulnerable, and um, you can't do anything about it. I don't like that feeling personally. I don't think most people do. Now, no. Dustin. No, 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 no at all. Now, Dustin is flipping him over the shoulder, and it looks like he's going for the back. A little bit, a little bit hot. <laughs> We're going to the corner, and Tyler West hits him. What's, what's wrong? Nothing, don't worry, don't worry. Let's continue commentating on the match. It's, um, I, he's going for a, um, a move here. What I'm thinking is going to be a nice enziguri. There's something wrong with me referring to a move as hot. And what's he doing here? He's um, coming back up. <laughs> Completely ignores. <laughs> and he Picking goes... Up. What's he going for? Is he going to sleep? Nope. It's an eat defeat. And what's he even good here? <laughs> he for the looks like both partners Go getting on. involved and there is a breakup. And Razor Ray looks like he's going to be taking advantage of it now as Tyler West squats. And now it looks like it is two on one. Nope, one on one because Razor Ray goes back out as Dustin now is taking it to Tyler West. Tyler West in trouble. Maybe, just maybe, you might want to think of tagging in Razor Ray who looks like he could probably take a few more rounds at the moment. But um, Dustin is definitely showing his expertise for some reason. Razor Ray actually clapped him on just there. Maybe, you know, sometimes you just, wow, Jesus Christ. You see how aggressively he went down against the mat. Wow. It was very aggressive indeed. Wow, and now he's going for the uh, submission, and you know what? That could, this oh, could be it. Choke cold. Is he going to tap here? Nope. What's he thinking? Just punches to the ribs. Uh, looks like. It. Nah. You see, I oh, uh, I do I, I do appreciate a little bit of technicality when it comes to wrestling. I obviously I um 
I do enjoy the uh, evolution that we seem to have gone by. And by that, I mean the fact that there's a, a lot more strikers in these days. You know, the type of people that they will hit hard and they will hit often. And that's their shtick. You know, that's what they do. But I do have to say, I do appreciate seeing a nice submission here and there. It's always a, a nice sight to see. I like watching people tap out. I've, I find it very interesting myself. Um, obviously, I've had um, offspring that I've um, learnt the technician style and I respect the technician style myself. <laughs> Why do you say it like that? I've had offspring. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I was so, I was so posh for no reason. I've had offspring and they <laughs> like the technicality. It's like, okay. <laughs> you have kids with the queen? The fuck? <laughs> she is a queen indeed. Oh, wow. That's, that's, that's sweet. That is, that is quite sweet. Uh, yeah, well, uh, if mix. you um, see here, if I show you my finger here, just, um, we'll ignore that pinfall. Well, you see my finger here, it's um, a tattoo of my wedding ring. Ah, yeah, did you lose your wedding ring? Is that why you got a tattoo instead? No, no, it, it wouldn't fit my finger anymore, so uh, the wedding ring is around my son's chain. You, around your son's chin? Chain. Oh, I was, I was, I was gonna say, <laughs> oh my god. Okay, uh, okay. All right, Tyler West with the forearm into the corner. That's a big chin. Um, <laughs> Dustin Kane <laughs> getting a few hits in. Now we got a suplex and it connects suplex. very nicely. And it looks like, oh my God, the tag actually does connect. I was never thinking he would be able to get there. And now we got a big suplex and he rolls out of the way. And now he's going for it. Oh no, he's going back for it. And I don't even know Ooh. what that move is called. Honestly, I don't understand. I don't know. Oh, it looks like he's going for that triangle choke for, for, for a second choco. time. Is he going to tap? I feel like this is it. He's going to tap out right here. How is he going to get out of this? I don't think he can. I think it's over. I nah, think it's I think good he, night. He, nah, he's got the strength no. to get out of it. Oh, pinch, punches to the ribs. He's about money, Ink, man. They are where the money is. To, in this day and age, where money is all about... Um, Literally everything is about the money, you know, they are bringing in the money and speaking of money If you wish to help BCW Because we you know since we're technically in a lawsuit with WWE because they stole our name and decided to put it on one of their In their in one of the new games uh, We're currently in a supposed lawsuit and um, Yeah, like if you want to help us out buy the merch go ahead and buy some BCW merch go ahead and buy some um Money Inc. merch. If you want some unfor uh, some forget forget forgotten error. Forgotten See, error. wow, I forgot the name of the forgotten error. That's that's yeah. ironic. That's very ironic. That's Go ahead and buy it. <laughs> ah, maybe that's what they have on the t-shirts. They're so forgotten that I forgot that they're forgotten. Now, we've got Razor, <laughs> Razor Ray bringing him down. Obviously, you guys will probably realize that there's three people down there, and they're clearly not us. No, this is the, uh, the, you know, it's like, just the, like, yeah, no, they're not important. Nah, they're just not. They're for the live crowds. Right. Yeah, pretty much. They're just there to pretend like they're doing things. We're the ones doing the real business, and we're out here in the skybox as we commentate over this fantastic matchup. Alex T Taylor, Alex T Alex, god damn it. <laughs> you know when you just can't speak and uh, you don't understand why? God. <laughs> Razor Ray bringing in Alex back into, uh, back into the ring as he now takes him into a corner and if I'm correct, oh, it's gonna be a spear. Predicted. Oh, you were right. He connects with the spear, the bloody crimson face of, oh god, it's Razor like Ray. you've seen this match before. It would be like I've seen this match before, but I haven't. You know what? I just stalked these, all of these guys. I just watched their wrestling. And now, Alex Ooh. going for the top of the head, going for the... Mounted the, strikes. Mounted strikes, yeah. And it's a smart move, clearly, as uh, uh, Razor Ray currently bleeding. You know, it would be a good idea to probably concuss your opponent. Obviously, don't concuss your opponent. That's a terrible idea. Obviously, you don't want to concuss your opponent because you you probably you know you might get into some trouble if you do that. So don't do it. And they might miss their match, and you might get really pissed off fans on Twitter. Yo, <laughs> the shots! <laughs> wow, wow! <laughs> oh god! Now we get another tag. 
and looks like Taylor is going to go up against Alex and he connects with the single leg takedown. Sing, no, not single leg takedown. Taking a leg drop kick. And now he goes for another single leg drop kick after a beautiful forearm. And now it looks like he might be signaling the end. This could be it. This could Open be it. Up. Goes for a second one. Eat, Eat the, the feet. feet. Now go, go for, for the cover. Right the cover one two broken up oh i'm broken up by um oh god razor razor having none of it dustin is now down on the canvas as taylor flexes really strangely i don't know weird flex but okay he's just <laughs> staring what jam yeah yeah just staring down you know the way that you should stare down it can also be a bad strategy that is Oh yeah, obviously you want to be get you get yourself a breather because if you've been in this kind of matchup for a long time, obviously having a breather is a good idea. But it looks like this could be it. Oh no, it's actually reversed. Oh. Alex reversing it. Maybe you're correct. Maybe it was a bad idea. Maybe he gave Alex a chance to get back into this matchup. Oh, the spinning neck break cutter. Next, yeah. I thought you were a veteran. You're supposed to. Oh my god! Oh my god! That that looks awful. Oh, oh and he I taps. Tap. He's tapping out. That looked. Oh wow! Jesus, that looked awful. Look at it. Look at his. Look. Do you see how he's just twitching on the floor? God, that yeah, was that awful. Bro. I told ah. you, technicality is all about it. Du I, I, what, was it Dustin who did the uh, technical move? Or was that Alex? I, sorry, I now. I've not but got do I, the great. Did I not say that these guys were going to win. Yeah, I guess so. But they did. They did fight valiantly. Both teams had a fantastic matchup. No love lost there. The crowd surely does show it. Obviously, great matchup for both of them. And congratulations to Immortal. Hopefully, this is only the start of an illustrious career here in BCW. Let's get right in to the next match.